Good morning Reefers, I'm Daniel and today I just want to do a little recap on this canister filter I've been testing out. This thing's a workhorse, it does a great job and with this multi-trace system you can really put a lot in there and get a lot of filtration in a small space. So I just wanted to give you guys a quick tip on how to remove this thing. So after you've cleaned up your tank, I don't know if you guys can see this, there is tons, nope, you can't see from this angle. Tons of macroalgae and shado and things that I picked up from around here that are in the siphon. So I just wanted to tell you, if you unplug it, all that's going to float away and get sucked up into the propeller that's right there underneath of it. Um, I'm going to just show you a quick little tip that I use. So you want to take a cup or a net. If you have a net, you can use something like that. Um, I don't really care about the water, I have tons of it. So I'm just going to put this under here. And now when I lift it out, all that junk that's on there is not going to get back in the tank. So there's a lot of crap. I didn't want to recontaminate my tank. So there you go. I'll take this out. All right, guys. I hope you enjoyed that quick tip. Just give you a little something to think about. That way, when you unplug your canister filter, that stuff doesn't float back in your tank. Um, you know, if you guys have something to add, something that you learned about your canister filter that you think would be helpful to share with everyone, go ahead and leave it in the comments. And as always, thanks for watching and happy reefing. Until next time. The eel did find a home in here. I see him poking his head out of a different hole each time. So right now he's up top and I can't get to him from this angle. But I just thought I'd share that with you guys. The eel seems to be very happy in there. We're still gonna build a cave for him over here. Uh, I just got pretty busy this weekend, it was my anniversary, and I did trade in my car this weekend, so I had to say goodbye to the Black Beast, I will miss it, and I did get to test drive though, too much, two fun cars in the process, so it wasn't all that bad. Alright, I forgot to tell you guys one more thing, I did just finish the Patreon page, uh, here's the link, check it out. Um, those of you who do want to contribute, I really appreciate it. Um, we do have some larger donation sizes if you want your name on one of the fishes on a mural on the wall in our new store. If you want it on the concrete or something, we're going to have some really cool stuff. So check it out. Let me know what you think. As always, thanks for watching. Happy reefing. Until next time. If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up and share with a friend, and thank you for being part of the Coralust community.